So that was Stay, performed by Emma Robinson, covering Rihanna and her computer distorted voice. And I think ending on this idea of um, how these software systems, after they've had some sort of influence, um, manifest in human activities that are sort of removed from those kind of computer manifestations. I, I, I want to present to you this video called Sunspring, um, which is performed by human actors. Uh, it's it's a, a, a small sci-fi short uh, that's done in kind of a very, uh, very kind of conventional manner, except for the fact that the script is computer generated. Uh, this is done using the machine learning uh, techniques that were discussed previously. But instead of being trained on images, they've been trained on, on scripts of popular sci-fi blockbuster films. Uh, everything from Jurassic Park to Existence by Cronenberg. And the, the machine then sort of learns, or in quotation, learns from all these uh, different texts and, and creates its own script. And it's really, really brilliant to watch then human performers trying to interpret or, or bring life to that script that's somehow sensical, but it never manifests in anything sensical. It actually becomes quite unusual and quite nonsensical. But for me, it's not just nonsensical. It's very dreamlike. It feels almost like a short by Michel Gondry because it feels like it's something that you'd only have it in a dream. Um, and a lot of these technologies um, are often discussed in terms of dreams as the machine dreaming. And, and perhaps dreaming is a, a good way of un understanding or analyzing what these, these systems do, because in a way, dreams often feel like uh, our brain sort of filtering all these inputs and trying to sort of make some sort of coherent sense of it. And then uh, in our dreams, lots of different inputs manifest and you, you, you'll see like an old childhood friend or your dog or something that you heard that day on the news sort of all mashed together. And I think this video short is the perfect computer generated dream. Um, so thank you, Stud TV for um, hosting me and, and letting me indulge in uh, my weird interest in computer generated content and, and how that's changed over the decades to the sort of art forms we're seeing today.